Hey guys, it's Alicia. And Jared. And we are here to do a Amazon WW haul. Thought that would be kind of fun to show you some of the stuff that you can order on Amazon that is WW friendly. We order a ton of stuff on Amazon, right? Like too probably much. way too much. Way too much. So I will have links for everything that I'm gonna be showing in this haul down below. It will be an Amazon affiliate link. I just recently set that up. So if you click on it and you buy anything through the link, I will get like a couple of pennies or something like that. Pennies from Amazon. Pennies from Amazon. So anyway, I'll have everything linked down below just so you can find it real easy. If there's anything in here that you are interested in. And some of this stuff we actually haven't tried. So we're gonna try that on camera and let you know what we think. The stuff that we haven't already had. So I'm gonna start with this case of protein 2O water. Now this was sent to us from the company. They were nice enough to send this to us so that we can try the different flavors that we haven't tried that are in the Amazon pack. So this one's got a couple different flavors I've never tried. So it'll be fun to try those and I'll let you know what we think of those. We have been drinking the ones from Sam's Club and we like those a lot. And these ones look like, well this one right here is the same flavor. Um, that's the tropical coconut that is in the Sam's Club pack, but two of these are brand new to us Okay, so that one is Dragon fruit blackberry. Okay. I'm typically not a fan of anything dragon fruit. So you might not like that one and this one is Peach mango which sounds really good to me. Yeah. I might, that one actually sounds good to me, too And these waters I really like they are protein infused they've got 15 grams of protein and there are no artificial colors, flavoring, anything like that. They are um, low calorie. So like this one's 70, what's that one? 70. Okay. So yeah, they're just a great way to get in a little extra protein. So I really like these like after a workout or something, or I take these on hikes too. You gonna try it first? I'll try this one. Ooh, that one smells good. I like that one. Try that. Not your favorite? That's not too bad. Tastes better than it smells. The other one that's in this pack, that's in the Sam's pack, is actually one of my favorites. The tropical coconut. That one tastes better? I like peach, anything. <sighs> See, I like that. Yeah. Well, you can have that one and I'll have this yeah, one. Yeah, I think that's good. We'll just leave those out so we can drink these as we're tasting everything else. So yeah, that is the Protein 2O case that you can get on Amazon. Next up, we got some candy. What are these? Smart Sweets. These are um, peach rings. Swedish fish. Sweet fish. Sweet fish, like Swedish. So uh -huh. I can't say the word Swedish. Gummy bears. And sour blast buddies. And each one of these bags is three points, which sounds pretty low to me for a bag of candy. Now, I assume these are, um, these are one obviously we haven't tried before. It says sweetened without sugar alcohol. How's it smell? Smells like candy. Now I'm a Swedish fish hound. Ooh, that's so good. They're real gummy. They're gummy? Let me try one. Kind of sticky. I'm just gonna try a bite of one then. Mm. Not bad. Don't want out Swedish fish. No, but not bad. I mean, for what, three points a bag? Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's not too And this bad. is 1.8 ounces. I think they all are, yeah. Let me try one of those, I didn't. Oh, these, these are, are the sour. sour it's supposed to look like Sour Patch Kids, obviously. That smells good. Mmm, that's good. Mm. I mean, mm. If you consider how many points 
an equal amount of that would be in um, sugar. Ugh. No, that one's not gonna. It smells like particle board. Ew. <laughs> These are peach rings. I'm hoping those are good because yeah. I like. Those are the ones I look forward to. I like peach rings. <laughs> that good? That is nasty. Mm, try that one. That's that's kind of good. What about the dog ain't over here? I don't know what they coated it with. Oh, it's coated, yeah. What they coated it particle board sawdust. Ugh. Yeah, that's not. That's nasty. That's not. I wouldn't go as far as to say it's not edible. I didn't say it's not edible. But it's pretty close. <laughs> it's nasty. So those are not good. Oh. I think the other three were good. And I think my favorite are the peach rings. Anything? Or you know. Yeah. He's going in for more, so. Those are, those are my favorite. That those and are, the fish. Those are pretty good. Stay away from them gummy bears. Yeah, those are kind of not so hot. Okay, next up. Oh. <laughs> We're gonna cleanse the palate with some turkey sausage sticks. These are new to me, but they sounded good. I love jerky, I love, um, don't even say anything. <laughs> I can tell where you're going. <laughs> anyway, these look good. It says refrigerate after opening, so it's a good thing I saw that because I probably would have left them out. But these are two points a stick. The dog is down here wishing that she could sample this one. I don't I'd think... have regurgitated those gummy bears in her mouth if she'd have been over here. Okay, I can't open this. Oh, yes, I can. So you want to just here? I just want to take a bite off of one. Or... <laughs> there you go. So two points a piece. Smells like turkey stick. It's good. Or does that now remind what, you too much of the... Now would you rather have this for two points or a jerky that we have? For one point. I would rather have the jerky, honestly. But this does almost have like a summer sausage taste to it. It does. That would be good is, with cheese. Yeah, that would be good with like a cheese stick, I think. So I think these are good. Yeah. Sure. That's worth two points. Definitely. Okay. So speaking of jerky. Jer gummy bears. Yeah, those gummy bears are gonna go in the trash, I think. I don't even think we get our son to eat those. That'd be cruel and unusual. Okay, so next up is, and we don't need to show all four of these, but we got four bags of um, Tillamook Zero Sugar Original Beef Jerky. Now, I discovered, well, I didn't discover Tillamook because I love Tillamook. I love Tillamook cheese. I love Tillamook everything. But we came across this specific product when we were traveling back cross country, right? Mm -hmm. And it is only one point for a serving, which is an ounce, I believe. Yes, an ounce. And I feel like, I, we don't need to try this, right? You wanna try it after the... Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, we've already had this. That stuff's expensive. This is expensive, um, but it's good. So I got four packs of that. Oh. That'll go somewhere. You finally found candy I wanna eat. I did find a candy you oh. would Okay, so here, got some goldfish. Now, not only do I love goldfish, you love goldfish, right? I like goldfish. Goldfish, I love goldfish. I don't love goldfish. My son loves goldfish, so I figure this will be a good thing for like pretty much everybody. Now, these are a little bit higher. If you do, I think it's like 55 goldfish is like four points, but if you do one of these bags, which is one and a half ounces, they are, what I say? I wrote all this stuff down, six points for one of these bags. No, so, not worth it. yeah, I mean, to me, I think it'd be worth it if I'm craving something like this. So I got these just so I can have them kind of as an option. And like I said, my son will definitely eat them. 
Okay, this stuff, Isopure protein powder, it is zero carb and how many proteins? 25 a scoop. And a scoop of this is one point. So I like to put this stuff in my smoothies. You like to put it. Woo. I put it in my oatmeal. In oatmeal, but we've been we've been using this stuff for I don't know, pretty long time now, right? Yeah. Yeah, and it's got a decent decent flavor for yeah, I like it. for zero carbs. So that's kind of our go-to protein powder. Okay, nut pots. I am one of these people that is always trying different coffee creamer. And so I saw somebody that was talking about this and they said it's really, really good. It's made of, it's non-dairy and it's made from almonds and coconuts. And this is the chocolate flavor. Oh, are you opening it? Okay. And um, it is a point for a tablespoon, I believe. Or maybe it's zero points, I need to scan that. Okay, so that is actually zero points for a tablespoon. So it's the same thing as my Coffee Mate creamer point-wise, which is zero points for a tablespoon. So zero points for a tablespoon of this. Try that and see what you think. Okay. Yeah, that's good. Let me try it. Just a little titch in there. I can see how that go really well with coffee. Yeah, I really like that. It's really creamy. I think that would go, go well with coffee. So I'll be trying that in my coffee here. Coming up. And it has two of that size in there. So this is off topic, but this this thing says that it's plant-based packaging inside. Mm -hmm. Ninety-five percent plant-based renewable raw materials. Now I don't know how much paper, how much of the tree is in paper, mm -hmm. but I'm pretty sure that paper's mostly tree. Yeah. So any paper product is probably pretty dang close to 95% plant-based renewable raw materials, right? Because the mm -hmm. tree is a plant yep. and it's renewable folks. <laughs> you know, it's kind of like a lot of different marketing where they tell you stuff that I could be wrong it's though. It's kind of like a duh, but anyway, maybe yeah. paper is mostly Something else? Something else. I don't know, not the paper I know. I mean, I know it's not a very nice process to make it, but. No. Okay, now these, moving on. Ooh, I'm looking forward to tasting these. These are Protein One protein bars. And that's strawberry and cream. And then this one is peanut butter and chocolate. We've not tried these, but they look good. And they are two points per pretty, bar. Pretty small. Pretty small, but two points of bar. You know, just give me a little bite of that. Oh yeah, okay. They're a little dense. <laughs> dense. Good flavor Which though. Which is good though. It makes you feel like there's more there. I actually like that. What do you think? No. I'm still trying to get the taste of the gummy bears out of my Oh, mouth. that's true. Those are never going away, probably. I can't even mm. open this box. Yeah, it's pleasant. Yeah, I, I think it's got a very pleasant, not a super protein bar taste. No. A little bit. I mean... I mean, it's not... It's a very subtle taste, period. Yeah, but it's good. So this is the chocolate peanut butter, and they are definitely on the small side. You definitely get the protein taste on the back end. And these come in a ton of different flavors. These are just the ones that I picked. Whoa, you're making a mess. I took another bite. Hmm. I think that's good. I think I like that one better than the uh, Strawberry, what do you think? It smells good. Oh yeah, I'm it. It is really chewy. I'm still chewing that same bite. I 
Yeah, that flavor just gets stronger the longer it goes, which is good. Yeah, it's good. I dare say this is chewier than the strawberry. Yeah, it's pretty chewy. So it may be small, but it's going to take you like an hour to eat it. So I guess. It'd be good to put with a lunch or something. Yeah. Midday snack. Okay, so now this stuff is Nutiva Super Seed Blend, and it's got coconut, or with coconut. It's ground flax, chia, and hemp seed with coconut. And this is something I've been using, I don't know, for a very long time, years. I put this in my smoothies, and it is, let's see here, two points for a serving, which is... Four tablespoons? That's not right. That's This is different. Well, let me check. That's a pretty big serving. I don't think that's right. I think on my old bag, it's for a um, tablespoon serving, but I could be wrong. Yeah, two points a tablespoon, which is all I put in my smoothies is just a tablespoon of this. So I was running low on that, and I really like using this. It's, it tastes good or adds a nice flavor to smoothies. You could use this for probably a lot of different things, but two points. Mix up. Got some of this Boom Chicka Pop in... I hope, yes, sweet and salty Calicorn. I have tried a whole lot of different Calicorns. And actually, I think my favorite one at this time is the Skinny Pop. I don't know. I can't remember what it's called now. But I wanted to try the Boom Chicka Pop just to see kind of how this compares. And one of these bags is five points. So that's a little higher than the other one that i like to buy but i don't know i thought it'd be fun to try the other one i like is i think it's four points for an ounce so it's a point higher it smells good You know, more of a classic uh, kettle corn flavor. Oh yeah, that's good. That's actually probably better than the other one that I'm currently eating, which I think is Skinny Bob, right? Yeah. Yeah, that's really good. I like that. And a lot of people, I see a lot of people talk about the, what is this, Angie's? Yeah, Angie's Boom Chicka Pop. The good stuff. Next up, Rice Krispie Treats. Now I like to make my own, but sometimes when I'm lazy, I just want to buy them. And these are four, four points, yes. Four points a bar, which is not very big. Not worth it. But I don't know, sometimes that's worth it to me. If you make them yourself, you get a whole lot more for the same amount, but. Less to be out there. Yeah, but again, there's also something Nice about just having them conveniently already there in package. So I'll buy those occasionally. Good when you're on a diet bender. Yeah. You can just peel them and eat them. You can just peel them and eat them real quick. Okay, and then lastly, I think this is the last. Picked up some of these Emerald Cocoa Roast Almonds. Now I've never had these before. You have. Mm -hmm. I want to try them. What are they? They are three points for a bag. So I'm gonna try them, just cause I'm curious. That is tiny. Almonds are high points. Okay, this bag is really tiny. It's a lot smaller than I thought it was gonna be, but oh well. That's what, what 0.62 ounce, so just over a half ounce for three points. But yeah, almonds are one of those things that's kinda high in general, just a plain almond. Did you want one? Yeah. Those are good though. Mm -hmm. Definitely good. But that's one where I would say, I don't think that's worth three points really. Yes? Okay, well, you can eat these and I'll eat the uh, Rice Krispie Treats or whatever else was in there you didn't think was worth three points. But yeah, that's it. That's um just some of the things that we buy and obviously some other things are new that we wanted to try from Amazon. And again, I will have the links for all this stuff down below. 
if you want to try any of this stuff yourself. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you on the next one.